In this video, I'll demonstrate some of the powerful tools in the AutoCAD Civil 3D section editor. This drawing contains a surface, an alignment and profile, a partial corridor, and two corridor assemblies. First, I'll view the corridor in section editor. The viewports that are shown are determined by the customizable section editor viewport configuration. I'll use the section editor to preview one of the assemblies at an empty portion of the corridor. The section editor displays the assembly. In Prospector, a green triangle indicates which assembly is being previewed. And on the Section Editor ribbon tab, the preview panel is available. I'll apply the previewed assembly, specify the station range to apply the assembly, and confirm the region name and assembly selection. Notice that I did not specify surface targets for the region. I will assign the targets in a moment. Next, I'll add another corridor region that starts where the second region ends. I'll confirm the region name and assembly selection and click OK. This time, I'm prompted to set targets. I'll set the targets, and the region is created. The assembly, including the surface targets, is displayed in Plan View and Section Editor. Next, I'll set the targets for this region. When the section is selected, you can use the section grips to edit parameters or targets of the current assembly and then apply those changes to a range of stations. For this demonstration, I'll click Edit Targets on the ribbon. I'll pick the region and then assign the targets. Finally, I'll change the first region to use the assembly that is used in the second region. A preview of the assembly is displayed before it is applied. The region is updated and the surface targets are preserved. The section editor provides a variety of powerful tools to edit a corridor model in section.